Hello and welcome back to our Let's Play of Civilization VI in what is probably our last episode, although every time I say that I feel like I wind up regretting it. We're... we have 123 tourism per turn, so we're about to really, really pop off. We're going to get to suffrage and then unlock more policy slots, get a bunch more uh, culture, use that culture to get up the culture to conservation, use conservation to buy naturalists, use naturalists to buy our um, national parks. Yeah, things are are all um, turning up millhouse here. So it's time to probably post, put a theater square in here. I really don't know if I'll have the time. I suppose we should do that. I should have bought the theater square when uh, Moksha was in town. Yeah, we'll just build a theater square. It's okay. There is a seaside resort. So we definitely want the Creaser Redentor. I need to figure out where to put the Creaser Redentor this time. This is a Plains Woods. So if I chop the Plains Woods, then this is probably still going to be a breathtaking tile. Yes. So I could still build another uh, seaside resort here. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and do that. Because the more turns it exists, the more tourism it provides. This builder can go back to sleep. This builder can come back to town and then go back to sleep. Actually, I wanted to send this builder over to Sao Paulo because I'm going to want second growth forests in here. And I'm going to want to remove some of these features so that I can get my national parks in place. There is a religious work of art. So now I have a religious work of art in here and then one in here. We can move this from the capital to Natal. And then... This was in Porto Alegre, but if I move this to the art museum in Porto Alegre, no. Let's let's move it to the art museum in Fortaleza. So let's also do that for this work. Can't be moved for three turns, but then yeah, we'll have an art museum in Fortaleza. That'll be it. I'm gonna move away. And I wonder if I can actually buy some religious great work, because I think that we're out of the era. Well, actually, the next great artist is going to be religious. So then we'll just have a triplicate. Trip, triplet. Yeah, a couple religious ones, and then we'll just buy another one. Let's go for... I'll tell you what. Let's go ahead and buy all of our walls, and then we'll switch to democracy. So this is going to be a minute or two. That's a sewer. Do I want to buy that sewer? Probably not the second. Nothing in here. I wish I already had uh, siege tactics unlocked. I probably won't get to Renaissance walls. All right, ancient walls, medieval walls. I wish the thing wouldn't close. I'm gonna move him to Fortaleza. Salvador has level two walls. Victoria has, oh gosh. Why is this the way that it is? Anyway, buying medieval walls, close this. Thank you. Ancient medieval. So the reason I'm doing this to be specific is theocracy gives me that discount on faith purchases. So if I go ahead and take my faith purchases while I can, then they're much cheaper, and then I can move towards um, democracy. Now that I think about it, maybe theocracy is worth sticking around in because I get such a discount on faith purchase so I can buy more naturalists. I did all this, and now I'm thinking maybe I should stick with it. What are the policy slots like? I have... Currently, I have four economic policy slots. Democracy would give me six policy slots and a discount on purchase with gold. That's fine. We've done everything we need to do with theocracy, and I'd rather have the um, extra economic boost. Like, I'd like to take Grand Opera and... Um, where's the bonus to adjacency... For the aesthetics. 
Trade Confederation is still fine to... I don't think this applies to Chichen Itza. It's a medieval wonder, right? No, it's a... Yeah, it's a renaissance and below. Yeah, so this is still fine. Let's run uh, Simultaneum up here. Let's run Aesthetics and Grand Opera and probably Rationalism. Or would I get more adjacency out of Natural Philosophy? Or actually, let's run let's run Take Confederation. I don't think that's changed. As far as diplomatic policies go, we want Merchant Confederation. Oh, faith per citizen in cities with governors. Ooh. We did lose out on a bunch of faith per turn. I think that's still fine. We're making 300 faith per turn. That's a lot of naturalists. Oh, we're actually back up to 400 and something. I don't know how. Maybe it wasn't counting my economic policies and the like. Let's build a sewer in here. The city was just a mistake. It was just a joke. Goodbye. So this is supposed to be this theater square, so I'm not going to build a mine here. I could come build a um, thingamabob there. Lumber mill. That's what it's called. This is going to be a chop. And then a seaside resort. So we'll build an amphitheater in here. We have another great work here. Let's build a lumber mill. Lumber mill. Goodbye. There's our canal. Which hopefully will give me a lot more gold from trade routes. I'm gonna actually build a trader in here. So I want to go for steel at this point. Computers would also be good as well because it would give me plus 25% tourism across my empire. I think steel is probably the right call, especially because I just bought a bunch of walls and renaissance walls are on the way to steel, so that's good. And I'm going to have a minute where... Ooh, I need to build a theater square in here. I'm going to have a minute where I'm going to have a bunch of um, cities that have low production, or uh, nothing to build, rather. So what next? This builder can go to sleep. This builder can go to sleep. This builder can get this rice farm going. This builder can go to sleep. And this one must build a seaside resort. And then we want to come over here to the seaside resort. Is this still... That's only charming appeal, so we need an Eiffel Tower for that. This is now only charming? Yeah, it's only charming. Sadly. Oh well, go to sleep. Actually, I do need to build, um, I need to build a lumber mill in Campo Grande. So there's civil engineering. We could build the Eiffel Tower, or the uh, Statue of Liberty somewhere, just to make sure that nobody can win a diplomatic victory. Is anyone even close? I'm actually leading with five points, so no. 176 gold. I don't think so. That's 480 or 470 gold and replaceable parts. I don't want replaceable parts, but knowing where it is can help me figure out, you know, where my chances to find things I do want are. Could build another trader, which seems like the right call. Didn't I build a trader out of here? No, I did not. So, the Chantry doesn't do anything for me still. I could make the Chantry do things for me, but I think 
Yeah, I could buy, I'm gonna have to save up a bunch of gold for tiles, but 985 gold for a chancery is not that bad, especially because then what I can do now is just commit some envoys here, increase the production of this city, and potentially build this stuff faster. And it is time to get uh, plus three for every broadcast that are in chancery. What is the Amadol's thing? Districts honor next to coast, late tiles, provide plus two culture. I think it's too late to benefit from that. I do a few banks now. But I don't need gold. I need I need uh, culture and I need science. I think this is fine for now. We have the ability to build indoctrination, so let's go ahead and do that. Now we can we have a policy slot to fill. What just expired? Public works. Skyscrapers, that's what it is. It's gonna keep building lumber mills here. Not that Natal can use them. So if, if Natal can't use them, why am I continuing to build them? I don't know. Let's stop doing that. And just like that, I've talked myself out of some doing stupid things. So it's time to buy a bunch of cultists, right? Cultist here, cultist there, knick knack, paddywhack everywhere, cultist. I don't really need to flip cities, I just want to get relics. Cultist out of Fortaleza. Cultist out of Recife. And we'll just stop. Bye. Cultist. I thought I was clicking that trader and I was like, what's going on? Ooh, this is still a, a slinger. I can boost metal casting by owning two crossbowmen, but I don't have metal casting, or I don't have I don't have crossbows yet, so it's okay. We'll hard build it. It's time for an art museum in here. Time for a broadcast center in here. While well, we still have the benefit, this builder is sleepy. This builder sleepy. This cult is gonna come over here to Akatanen. Let's go over to Thebes. It's only gonna take four turns. And this cultist will take five turns to get to Songdal. And then let's go ahead and take the disguise promotion, I guess. Whatever. So we want to buy more cultists because I want to get a bunch of those uh, relics in place. I do want to be mindful of my faith because I want to have enough for naturalists. So this is probably the only round of cultists that I'll really need. I'm gonna put like eight, eight relics is probably enough because I'd rather have naturalists once I get up to, uh, oh, we got the Petra. Okay, that's cool. We're up to seven population here. Let's uh, let's place our theater square. We want it right here. And then in this city, let's uh, build our street carnival. I'm gonna just go ahead and build that because it won't. I won't be able to build the amphitheater in time for uh, the next session. Man, we've got a lot of use out of that theater square boost. Where is um, Moksha? Moksha is here. Why aren't we buying a theater square in here for Faith? And then we know we're going to need gold for this, so let's go ahead and just buy its infrastructure. There you go. Art museum in here. It's going to be just in time, basically. And I think the capital is just done. Like, what else do I build in here? Where does Cristo Redentor have to go? I think it has to go on a hill. Cristo Redentor. Must be built on hills. So I could build that in Belo Horizonte. 
which will be benefiting from Chichen Itza very soon. I don't know if there's a really good spot for it. Maybe Manaus? Manaus has good production. 25, 27. It doesn't have good production. Okay, I'll figure that out when I get there. But for now, I don't need anything to do anything with this capital. So I think I'm going to go ahead and just generate some culture. Right. Oh, no. We're out of power. So this cultist can come over here, just like this other cultist was doing. Let's build an amphitheater in Florianopolis. We get a promotion here. Let's take linguists. That way we're making more money. I'm going to steal the boost for military science. Because that will also reveal where mili military science is, and I can avoid it. This cultist can come over here to this city like... This other cultist is doing. And we're gonna skip or fall asleep here. This builder can also fall asleep. I really need more science, which is what Renaissance walls could do for me. There's natural history, so now we have antiquity sites to deal with. Man, I might actually uh, convert a couple of these cities. I actually have a cultural alliance with him, so no, never mind. What I saw was the reducing uh, Eastern Orthodoxy. And let's take a broadcast center in here. I'm not going to have power, but I think I can go for a power-free game. That seems fine. Could build the Panama Canal. Man, a planet canal. I think this city is basically done as well. It's at its housing limit, actually. So I could build a neighborhood somewhere. This is a plus six neighborhood. This is also a plus six neighborhood. Let's build this plus six neighborhood. And then that also potentially, potentially get me up to a harbor, which will get me another trade route. I've got six envoys to send. So I might as well go ahead and get some more. Let's take science, actually. I'm behind on science. Oh. Apparently you only need to knock someone off of being suzerain. You don't need to actually uh, become suzerain of that city-state to get the era score. Okay. So this builder, we're going to get in place for second growth forests because we're a few turns away from conservation. Speaking of which, we're going to remove these tiles. To increase the appeal. I could take military research after Limes. Like, Limes is basically done. Well, we're gonna have one more round of Renaissance Wolves, so this, this is fine. Everything's fine. Oh no, there's something that's standing there. Just come over here. No, I already told you no policies. This is a bug in this mod. This is a mod that reminds me to change policies, which is really, really good. I think it should be part of the reg regular user interface. In fact, it might be, because they may have improved the interface. But regardless, I'm used to the mod, so that's what I'm rolling with. But anyway, there's a bug where it continually asks for you to... Um, I don't need more great work slots, really. Let's take a temple. Why not? I guess the Broadcast Center gives me more great people points per turn, which helps me close the gate faster. That's why, to build a... Ooh, we could build a harbor in here. Or a commercial hub. It's a plus three hub. I'm starting to need electricity. I think I prefer the plus three hub to the plus one harbor. 
The city's up to seven population, finally, so we can place this theater square. Oh, Bello, Bello Horizonte should have placed this theater square long ago. But anyway, we're going to finish the Chichen Itza first. One turn away from that. Let's swap this tile. Let's place this theater square. This is 17 per turn. Oh my gosh. I kind of wanted to see what was up with the um, canal. See if the canal is actually any good. So let's transfer to Salvador da Bahia. And we have a great musician. Excellent. We're now up to six envoys again, so might as well get some extra culture. Man, I've just not been impressed by cultists. They don't really reduce the loyalty of cities that are already in place. It seems like they only work for cities that are starting to falter in their loyalty. Which is fine, like, whatever. I'm really impressed with the relic, or that's what I'm hoping for, is the relic. I'm gonna say that I generate more grievances, not that anybody's going to matter. And let's take Catholicism getting combat strength. I should have actually taken the Condemn, so I should have taken Condemn for Sikhism, if I were min-maxing. Because I'm not going to go to theological combat with him, I'm going to kill his units. I don't need the university, I need the theater square. We have a great person, which is this religious artist, which is great. I'm going to move him over here. There's a themed museum. Let's, um, let's move this great work into... Um, sure. Actually, Rio. There. And I can create a great work again. Oh, let's build this broadcast center. Here, 10 turns for an art museum or 2 turns for a shrine. I think a shrine is probably better. Just because of the turn cost. So then we start... Recruiting followers. Oops, no, don't move. Don't move. Oh, yeah. 27 gold per turn. This canal is so great. So there's the loveless ones. And there's the Tome of Dagon. This feels much better than my previous Let's Play, in which I, uh accidentally uh, <laughs> built all of my, or uh, used up all my charges where my slots were full so I didn't get the relics. Oh my gosh, there are so many notifications. Please just go away. There's conservation. Siege tactics is done, so now we can build renaissance walls. So this, this must be flight. Or sorry, that must be steel. So we're going to go towards steel. This could be flight. This could be flight. All right, so Renaissance walls time for sure, because we... Hmm. We're closing out the game. We need walls. Especially because we're going towards steel. Let's actually build the walls first. I'd rather build the walls than buy them with faith because... Um, oops, no. I want to finish the art museum and then build walls. The reason being that I'm now about to purchase a bunch of naturalists with this faith. I can afford three naturalists right now. Let's build Renaissance walls and build them. And in here... 16 turns, it's going to be too late. I feel like 8 turns is the maximum that I'll accept, and then I'll have to buy the others if I want them. But, oh my gosh, production. Renaissance walls. Oh, I keep produce. I keep clicking the faith buy. 10 turns might be too late, so I'm going to just avoid that. 
This is fine. Oh, there's not even medieval walls in here. What about Manaus? Six turns for walls. Okay. And in here, seven turns for walls, especially because we're building a project. Definitely. All right. I think that's everywhere that can definitely build them down here. Let's come up here. I have so many cities, so many cities. Five turns for walls for sure. I want to build that before the neighborhood. I really just don't need that city to do anything else for me. Five turns for walls in the capital. Five turns for walls in here. Three turns for medieval walls in here. And then we'll build renaissance walls after that. Five turns for walls in here. Okay, I think that's all of the walls that I can build. Don't need any more envoys. We have faith. We can purchase naturalists. So these national parks are good. But I'm going to go for the ones that are the best. I could actually also become Scissor and have two so I can walk my naturalist through their territory, which is a little safer. It also shows me whether there's barbarians in here to uh, eat my things. Let's just do that now. Okay. So it should be fine. I'm going to prioritize national parks that are fully within my borders first. Actually, I should, I should prioritize the ones that are breathtaking appeal, which are all of these. So I'm going to build a naturalist in Rio and a naturalist in Bello. And let's see. I guess none of them are available just yet. Oh, I guess I can't because she's out of movement. I wanted to be able to see if there was a um, national park in here as well. So Natal has a religious um, art museum. Let's go ahead and take gain sources. Boom, boom, boom. There's a relic. Boom. Go ahead and build a, another lumber mill here. This cult is going to recruit. This cult is going to recruit. There's another great work. Let's go ahead and make our forests here. Our forests here. We definitely want a naturalist in Sao Paulo. We don't have enough faith. Next turn we'll buy a naturalist in Sao Paulo. And then we can get... Actually, this could be a national park. We're probably not going to have time to grow out to this one. Although, is it better? Let's see peel lens. Well, they're all breathtaking. That's 10. How is this breathtaking 10? 11, 9, 6, 5. Okay, so this is actually a better national park. 4, 4. I guess woods are really powerful next to each other. So I want this to be my first national park in this area for sure and then this one and then maybe this one although i'm gonna to need to buy those tiles for that actually that can't be a national park can it let's see no it can be a national park out of manaus so your city has to own all of the tiles and so when i was looking at south palo i was going one two three four but if we come over from manaus one two three one two three one two three so it could be a national park out of manaus and i just dropped my mouse so let's go next turn. I want this to be a national park as well. I'm just going to keep making forests with this builder. As a matter of fact, this builder still has some charges, so let's come build forests over here so that I can buy this national park. There's a great person. Actually, I only need to build one forest here because I only am going to own this one tile. There's Mary Shelley. Let's take her. Mary Shelley, come over here. Again, move great works out of Rio to somewhere else. And then create great works here. Great. 
Oh, I need a builder to remove... Oh, shoot. I need a builder to come remove this feature. So, this naturalist can come... Ooh, we can cancel build a forest here. Can I not designate a national park here? What are the requirements? Oh, there's an improvement here that I have to remove. So we're going to have this builder just remove these improvements. This is actually a little bit of a min-max problem. There's a national park. Why can't this be a national park? I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll make a naturalist over here and then we'll see what we can do. I should be able to make two. Oh, man. There's all our cultists. Let's see where we are in terms of tourism. We're generating 300 tourism per turn. Oh my gosh. That is a lot of tourism per turn. So I'm just going to have her skip her turn. I'm going to have this cultist. Make another great work. I need to make sure that I'm trading with every player at this point. So who am I trading with? Cleopatra, Poundmaker, Tamiris, Harold. I'm not trading with um, him. I need to trade with him. As a matter of fact, I could buy a trade route. Let's do it. And then there's another great work. And then he's going to make a portrait. So I'm going to just come to one of the city centers and do it there. Step aside, builder. There's rifling. Landscape. It's not a portrait, it's landscape. All right, so I think the right thing to do is build a forest here, then come remove this tile, have her skip her turn one more time. Yeah, we're gonna skip her turn again. Let's come check this naturalist out. What is going on with this situation? How come I can't create an, a national park? All the tiles must be natural wonders, mountains, or an appeal of charming or better. All four of the tiles must be owned by the same city. All of the tiles must be contiguous and form a vertical diamond shape. No tile can have an improvement or a district. So this should be eligible, right? What's the appeal of this tile? It's breathtaking. So could it come make a national park here? Must be on a valid national park tile. Well, I guess I can only make a national park here. I would like to make this a national park. But if I have to cut one, then so be it. Whatever. This just has such good breathtaking appeal. Like, this national park is worse, right? Well, I guess it's not that bad. It's pretty freaking good national park, probably the best one that I'll have in the Empire, so I'm not going to complain about it. But it is time to buy another naturalist, isn't it? Wait, probably 900 faith. Yeah, 900 faith now, so. This builder can go to sleep. This trader, we need to trade with Hungary somewhere. So that's probably the best I can do. This city... We have a builder that isn't doing anything right now. Just fall asleep. I'm torn between building naturalists and building... Um... Oh, sure, let's give him an A request. And renaissance walls in the cities that can't actually get to the renaissance walls. I think that naturalists are probably better because I mean, look at the appeal of my tiles. Okay. Well, we can only make this national park, so let's make it. And then we'll make it better by improving the forest there. This national park will be ready next turn, so I'm going to go ahead and move her in place. And I can buy another national park, which could be this one. This naturalist is already in place. Actually, I'll move her here. And then I'll buy another naturalist out of here. 
then I'm waiting for these tiles so I can make this a national park. I need a builder over here to remove the feature. So that can be a national park. This city can build Renaissance walls. I could go ahead and take military research, but I'm waiting on Limes. And then what just became obsolete? I think the plus one science and plus one culture from trades. Let's take triangular trade or no, let's take rationalism. Because all of them have high adjacency already. There's nine science. Gosh, maybe natural philosophy would have been better. Oh, we've got a promotion with this one. I'm going to say disrupt rocketry just in case. And then we'll start sealing gold again. So I can go ahead and build a mine here. We have to choose an escape route. We always want to go on foot. And with this Shirtumlik, let's go ahead and gain sources. Didn't I already gain sources somewhere else? I'm not paying attention to this spy thing. I'm, I'm going to be honest. So we're going to remove this improvement, right? And then we're going to designate a national park here. So we're definitely going to fuel ourselves into another golden age, I'm sure. Just based on the number of national parks that I have. We're almost ready to buy one more. I think maybe this one's next. Let's actually look at the appeal of these tiles. This is breathtaking. Four, 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 five. That's not a great one. What about these? Oh yeah, this is darker green. So I can also come back with a builder later on and um, add woods. Like, boom, woods here. This is better. Glad I didn't really sweat this national park situation too bad. I mean, I would be upset if I had a small empire and I hadn't gotten to the point where I felt like I could win the game. That's for sure. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this tile. I'll probably buy those tiles too, so I can make that a national park. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the feature here with this builder. I'm gonna add woods with this builder. We're gonna buy a naturalist out of this city. And then we'll buy those tiles. Let's just go ahead and buy them too. Um, I wonder if I can go ahead and swap in the land surveyor's card. I don't really need to save myself the gold, it's fine. Boom, boom. And then in Belem, let's uh, buy those two, three, four, five. So now we have some national parks. We also need to build builders out of here too. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna send this builder to come over here and clean up some stuff. Chop this, make woods. There's an amphitheater. Might as well, right? If I'm in for a penny, I must be in for a pound. It really doesn't matter, like, Maybe that wasn't the right thing to do, but I still have 2,000 gold left, right? Let's build a, another theater square here. Or a broadcast center. Ooh, whoa. I just cleared your movement. Come down here. There's that revving engine again. Seems farther away this time, so that's better. I'm gonna build an amphitheater in here. This builder can come remove this feature for this national park. Let's actually swap all the tiles for this. Actually, I can't, so let's swap all the tiles this way. And then the capital has all of these tiles. Is that right? That's correct. So this natural says skip her turn, skip her turn. Man, those features, they really did a number on me. I'm missing out on so much tourism by just even delaying these national parks because I built them in the wrong place. All right, so remove this improvement, designate this national park, come down here, remove this improvement. I'm going to go ahead and remove this pen too because I know that we're all good. 
over here, I could choose between a temple and an art museum. I'm gonna go for an art museum just to give myself even more great person points. We really don't need the, uh, when your empire is this large, you really don't need that extra uh, carnival project. Let's go ahead and take Curator, because we actually have some tourism out of the city now. Where is it? The capital, yeah. I'm gonna build woods here. And let's see, what are the appeal of all these tiles? I think this is actually a better national park than this one, so we'll make this a national park first. After mass media, we'll get Cristo Redentor. Then we'll um, look for professional sports so we can make mountains out of the ones that we left behind. Did I build a mine here? Did I No, I didn't want to build a mine. I wanted to build a forest. Oops. This builder... Yeah, we're ready for the next turn. Yeah, I think all of our policies are fine. Actually, let's switch out for natural philosophy. Let's, let's actually see if it's better. Natural philosophy. Natural philosophy looks like it was a little bit better, maybe? Can't quite tell. National Park here. All right. And there's the next turn again. I wonder how close I am to winning. I am leading. I'm generating 500 tourism per turn. We have another great person. I'm waiting for these extra tourism uh, ones over here. I guess we take this landscape guy. We can move him over to these theater squares down here and have these be landscape theater squares. Let's finish our commercial hub in here. And in here, let's finish our theater square. In here, I want a broadcast center, probably. Probably not a temple, right? I mean, I am using the faith, but I'll run out of uses for the faith. Oh, I won't run out of uses for the faith. Um, yeah, let's just build a temple. I am using this tile, so I might as well build a lumber mill on it. It'll take me a one more turn, maybe two more turns, before I can get that to be a national park. Plant woods. Thank you. Creaser Red and Tor will be really, really good. Which means now it's time to figure out where to build it. because we just unlocked it. Let's see, where are we going on civics? Cultural heritage, have a theme building. There's professional sports. So we wanna go for professional sports at this point. One promotion level and 50% combat experience to a military naval unit. Let's just pass on her. There's an off chance that we get a good, good admiral, a good great admiral, AKA a good admiral. So let's boost synthetic materials. We want to trade with um, Hungary. I want to make sure I'm trading with Tamiris too. Yes, I am. All right, are you ready? No, you're not ready. <laughs> this spy is ready for being deployed somewhere else. That's fine. Let's go to the next turn. Great work here. I think I'm just gonna go until I win. There's not much more point in continuing this. And then I can come build this in this theater square. There's steel. Oh, a steel's a modern tech. I didn't realize steel was modern. I thought it was uh, industrial. We've got another great writer. So we can do the same thing. Move Mary Shelley's works to another city. Boom. Make a great work. Cool. Build an art museum in here. 
yeah, we're starting to pop off here. Could build a street carnival, which would improve the adjacency of the theater square, but I think I would rather build a Copacabana, if anything. What else could I build in here? I could build a sewer to grow the city more. That would give me more science per turn. I don't think I need to grow the city. I think I need to build more great people. So let's build a Copacabana, and then we'll just run that project out of there. We can remove this feature, finally. And then let's just designate the national capital. Excellent. Oh, I'm up to 2,000 faith, so I need to buy some more national parks. I got kind of. I'm not gonna get these just yet because it takes me a while to walk around, and they. I need to build these forests anyway. I guess I could get one of them. Naturalist here, and then. I kind of want this one out of Duke first. Actually, let's buy the natural cell on this side because it'll take her less time to walk. We have another great person. That's a great musician. Same thing, come to Rio. Move the great works to other places. Broadcast center. Yeah, let's move it to a broadcast center. So that technically, it, technically, if we decide to buy more cultists, then we have we'll have maximum um, faith generation. So it's now or never. We buy Renaissance walls or we don't, and I think we we just don't. We don't need it. Let's get an amphitheater. I'd rather get this uh, get these national parks quicker. It's going to be worth a lot more tourism than just one more tourism per turn. There's a great work, and then we can move over here and create another great work. Cool. This is themed. We need to move this, actually, over to this museum. I need one more religious work of art. Ooh, they're having religious wars in my territory. There's totalitarianism. We can decide to be fascist if we want. Ooh, shopping malls available. I think I wanted the extra food, didn't I? But I guess it doesn't matter now. It's a mood point. Whatever, I got my breathtaking neighborhood and that's all I really needed. I could go up to shopping malls here because I don't have any more um, buildings to produce in the theater square here. Yeah, I'll pull the shopping mall out of here. Oh, I forgot to decide where the Cristo Redentor is going. Oh my gosh. Cristo Redentor, no suitable location. There is a suitable location right here. But it'll take 34 turns. This will take 31 turns. This will take 30 turns. How does this city have the best production out of all of these? 30 turns out of here. I'm not going to build it out of Sao Luis because I want to start the Eiffel Tower in Sao Luis. 38 turns, 34 turns, 50, 89, 80, 30. I know these are, like, why am I even trying these down here? What about uh, Fortaleza? Fortaleza has some pretty good production. 26, no it doesn't. Recife actually now has pretty decent production. Did I ever find out factories? Yes, I do have factories. So I need to purchase a factory and a coal power plant. And now, maybe this is a Cristo city. Yeah, 26 turns. Yep, that's what we're doing. It's going to be right here. Campinas. Uh, let's build a broadcast center. We don't want to change governments. Let's just steal gold. This national park is going to come over here. Mm, I don't think we need to change policies. Actually, we're not building any more um, walls, are we? I think we're done with all the walls. Yeah, so we're done with walls. Let's switch this out for the uh, military research card. 
that gives us a little more science per turn. So we get to steal faster, we get to computers faster. There's another great work. So I think, yeah, the, the game is basically done. It won't take too long for these uh, cities or for these uh, opponents to be knocked over by this overwhelming onslaught of national parks. Ugh, this builder is in the wrong place at the wrong time. I should actually just wait for the builder to move. This naturalist can come over here. We actually already have a coal. I could build, yeah, let's get our builder over here. Boom, boom. National park. And then we can build woods around here now that we have the tiles and get the coal. Excellent. As a matter of fact, I'm going to move this builder down here. Am I? Do I need anything else? No, this, this builder will be fine. Fortaleza. Let's build a market. Should I build a market or should I just actually just go for great person points? I think at this point I should just go for great person points, but I'm going to just build the market so I can get another trader, just because that's the more fun thing to do. We're not going to build these renaissance walls. I'm probably not even going to buy them. Well, you know what? I'm at this point where I'm generating science per turn off of them too. Um, let's just, why not? Just for the lulls. I'm going to get all of this back very quickly anyway. Let's do a search for renaissance walls. I guess I decided to do it. And now every city except Victoria has them. Yeah, that's fine. Do we not have ancient walls, medieval walls? No Renaissance walls in here. Oh, for some reason. Oh, because Moksha is still here. We need to reassign Moksha to somewhere that's actually building a district. Or could build a district. You know, I'm gonna just reassign Moksha to Karitiba. Karitiba. And use him to uh, double the pressure of Catholicism in here. I'm gonna build a sewer in here. Because why not? In Campo Grande, we can build a Ferris wheel, which gives a little bit of tourism. All right, there's another great person. There's a Santa. So we're one shy of a religious work in here, so I'm going to move him to Fortaleza. Critical religious work out of there. What's this other thing? A landscape? Titian. It's time to renew our alliances this turn. And I think I decided I'm going to play to the end here. Asunta, Salome... Equestrian portrait of Charles V, so I'm assuming that's a portrait. If it's a landscape, I would be quite uh, surprised. Friendships all around. I probably should be doing both friendship and alliance in the same go, but... Religious. Pay me. Boom. Okay. I think we said research here. Pay me. Pay me more. Great. There she is, military. Pay me. Herald, let's say economic. Pay me. And cultural. Pay me. You got it. What could I build in Victoria? Could build an industrial zone for these cities down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it doesn't benefit. I mean, why not build an industrial zone in here? It doesn't really do anything, but it's something to do. We're going to build an amphitheater in here. 
Just keep economizing till we win. Gosh, this national park is really annoying. I should get a military engineer. Actually, I need a encampment for that. Okay, so there's steel. The next thing to do is get computers. So we're gonna go just beeline that. That way we can also build flood walls in case the sea level rises, but we're gonna build the Eiffel Tower next turn. Just wait for the broadcast center. Broadway could go here, I suppose, but that's uh, not a very good wonder. Free rate musician points per turn. Like, what else is the city going to do? I guess I could get a bunch of great person points. Yeah, let's just build theaters for festivals. Get more great person points, get our rebate because we're um, Pedro, so we can get those great person points back. We could build Broadway in here. No. Like, we're done. We just need to close out the game. Once we get to, um, in a couple turns we get to professional support, so we should actually swap in the builder card. Something can be here most elite. Oh, it was a five-year plan here. That's fine. Let's go ahead and swap in, um, where is it? New deal. No, it's um, public works. Let's swap in public works and let's start making a couple builders. Four turns for a builder here, and then this builder can make some um, professional sports things. Let's get a builder out of here. So many things to produce in here. You know what? Let's build a builder in here. Send him up to Quarrel Host. Bellum could use a builder, although it actually has productive things going on. Let's just purchase a builder in this area. Um, I think everything's fine as it is. I could become Scissor and Hattusa again. That's what I need to do so I can walk through their territory. So there's our themed museum, right? Fortaleza is themed. Great. They can fight over second place, that's fine with me. They're never gonna make me not Catholic. Because we love the Pope. All right, same thing here, moving. Here, moving these out over to somebody else. Creating great works here. Let's go over a trader. I should take a spy. I think I'll take an art museum. Gives me more great person points per turn. Yeah, 55 great person points per turn. We're not even really running projects. Good night. All right. Um, Eiffel Tower. That's what we were doing. 25 turns for the Eiffel Tower. Boom. How close are we to winning? 45 out of 231. 600 tourism per turn. Good night. Hey, there's a national park here that I didn't even think about. I'm gonna get another naturalist out of Belem. Actually, we want this one over here because it's ready to go. Boom. Let's take a temple. This builder is waiting for professional sports. Wait, we can chop? 
removes the sheep from the plot. I mean, okay. What happens when I do this? No, nothing. Okay. I thought it might have crashed the game or something. That's why I did it. Alright, bonus amenity extends to each other within six tiles. Plus one science to each rainforest and marsh tile in the city. That's kind of interesting. I think maybe the right thing to do would be the Statue of Liberty. Or just build, let's build the carnival. Carnival. Come on. Thank you. We're done with Salvador. Thank you very much for all you've done for us this game. There's Manaus. What are we doing with Manaus? Dear buddy, I could build the Big Ben. I think someone else is already building Big Ben. Let's just, let's build a theater square festival. We just need to get more and more great people. Fill our slots. Get our game done here. Art museum. I'm just gonna put my spies to sleep because I don't need them anymore. This is another religious great work. So maybe I should come to Manaus for that. Because I think I have enough portraits that I can make a themed museum. I'll have to move the artwork around. It'll be fine. Steel gold. Someone built something. Oh boy, look at all of these. Uh, coast tiles in the capital. Wow. They're out all the way out to here. You would think these would belong to Belo Horizonte, but apparently they don't. I'm going to go ahead and move the fish tile over. Nope. Okay, never mind. Well, once it's done, it's done, I suppose. So, uh, let's go ahead and chop here and build a seaside resort, right? Appeal. Charming. Breathtaking. I don't need the coal. I guess I should actually... I should have done the coal. Yeah, with this builder. So we're going to remove the improvement. We need to buy another builder in here. This builder. Yeah, this city's basically done. I'm going to use this builder to make these uh, forests over here. Actually, no, this builder has five charges. I didn't realize. Okay. I don't need the aluminum. I need to maybe connect the fish. Just playing scatterbrained right now. Build our dam. 28 gold per turn. Oh boy, that's a lot. Um, kind of like where we are. I still need a couple more builders in the empire. There's a national park. Beautiful, there's our um, Golden Age. Did we ever even get a Dark Age this game? Maybe we had a classical Dark Age. I think we did have a classical Dark Age. Wow, three great people per turn. Or in a single turn. Don't We don't need Adam Smith. There's Rembrandt and Bach. So what does Rembrandt do? He does portraits, right? So this is going to be a portrait city. Actually, I think Rembrandt's first is a religious. So we have three themed religious buildings, I think. Oh, this is an... Yeah, so that's a landscape. Whatever, I'll just have him go somewhere like Porto Alegre. That's fine. Oh, that's not who I wanted to do. Oh well, we'll do the same thing that we usually do. Rembrandt can come to... I don't know. Bella Horse. That's not what I wanted to do. I guess we can build a religious work in here and then see what's next. Caritaba. 
Well, not a bank. That's yeah. Let's build a couple theater square festivals. An aquarium would give me more amenities, but I'm not having an amenities problem anywhere. This city doesn't have housing. Let's build a sewer. Same thing with Florianopolis. Oh no, they're of the wrong religion. So they've lost out on a little bit of production per turn. I'm gonna ask her not to convert my cities anymore. Ask for promise. Don't convert my cities. No, no, this is for the best. Okay, well. Time for an Inquisitor. Ugh, the Barbarian. Did I lose a naturalist to this Barbarian? I think I did. This area seems so clear. Free and clear. I'm gonna skip my turn. I'm gonna pay more attention to this naturalist and not waste it. I think I just wasted this builder because he's gonna walk away. So there's a mine, more coal. We get toys. Just come over to the city center, I guess. Let's hope this city, um, city state moves first. Oh yeah, this is this is danger. Well, I'm not gonna let her get killed, so skip your turn again. I'm saying that as if I really need that national park. I do not need these national parks. I just need this game to be over. Art museum. We were gonna chop and then build a seaside resort and then maybe get this lumber mill or this coal mine. You can actually build a coal mine with the forest still in place, but it does reduce the appeal, so. Let's get, let's get a university. Why not? We'll get a little bit of extra science per turn. And it's finally the chance to make a decision that's different. It's a major defeat. I'm going to purchase an Inquisitor out of here to come convert this again. Oh, I had a promotion. Oops. So this trader, let's just trade here. Whatever. I'm losing out on a bunch of gold by not putting it in the right place, but I really couldn't care less. I just need this game to be over. Like, it's, it's clear to everyone, myself included, that uh, this is over. It's just a matter of actually phoning it in. Uh, my builder was captured by bar barbarians. I'm just going to give up on those over there. Yeah, if we don't make it there, we'll, we'll just give up. Because I'm not going to build a military just to come clear out this barbarian camp. Why isn't Hattusa? doing its friggin' job. We could levy the military here. There we go. And then maybe, maybe I can find my naturalist. Oh, that's why. There's only one pikeman. Pikeman shot. Sorry. He has the musket. Let's build a thingamabob there. One there. And then we can make more from ski resorts over there. Let's get, um, where's a builder? Let's buy a builder. And then we'll buy a naturalist for this national park. This builder is gonna make a seaside resort. And then we'll come over here for this. There we go, there is a ski resort, another ski resort. This builder, we can make ski resorts here. There's two. This spy, oh, I'll just go to sleep. All right, so now we can get um, 
Let's go to digital democracy. We might just take digital dem democracy. I don't know if it even matters. And then that unlocks a bunch of text that might actually give the, us the um, extra tourism. What are we doing in Rio? I guess we're just building great people. Boom, 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 boom. Sure, sports media. Why not? We have a builder over here that can build us uh, some things. So this builder has done everything it needs to do. We can come get this going, get some, um, yeah, we're, we're good. Things are going well. So this inquisitor, I guess I bought one too many inquisitors. I thought that we would have a fight around here. Oh, we have a promotion. Okay, whatever. This unit needs orders. A portrait, a portrait, and then a religious. Where's a portrait? Recife. Let's move. Oh, can't be moved for another few turns. Let's make Salvador's art museum a portrait museum. And then we'll make Recife's also a portrait museum and we'll remove, yeah, we'll move the landscape later. I have 61 military strength. It's kind of rude of you to point that out. Not gonna lie. Instant lighthouse and shipyard, that could be good. Where did Moksha wound up? He, oh, whoops. Let's bring Rembrandt down here. I could actually move him to, let's move him to Natal. We can build a harbor out of Natal. Five turns for a harbor. Once Natal gets to, up to population, we'll buy one of those for Natal. I would like to get replaceable parts. Where is replaceable parts? It must be, did I already research it? Yeah, food market. I wanna buy a food market in here. Can I do that? Purchase. Can a food market, oh, I didn't even finish the neighborhood, did I? Oh, I built a shopping mall in here. Womp womp. Speaking of which, let's get a shopping mall. So maybe this is not the right place to try and get a harbor. Whatever, we'll just keep him there, it's fine. We'll, we'll tell him to shut up. Let's just go with the Square Festivals here because we're basically done. There's a portrait, and then we need a religious work somewhere. Ski resort here, ski resort here. Continue to trade with lots of gold. Oof. Another great work. This builder is going to remove this feature. We're going to buy a naturalist out of here, and we're going to buy this tile. Uh, sleep. Sleep. Swordsman, come down here and help out. Oops. There's next turn. I'm glad my naturalist is safe. <laughs> Let's remove heresy. So now we have production back in this city. Woo. Ski resort here. Pike and Shot comes over and fights the swordsman, I think. Ski resort here. 
Yep, ski resort. Two there. There's combustion. Ski resort there. Boom, 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 boom. Oh wow, I'm at 189 era score. Let's get an aquarium, why not? Oh, we were going to, to do great person points out of here. Could always just buy this aquarium because this gives me aquatic server gives me plus two tourism for each wonder built in the city on or adjacent to a coast tile. Oh, we definitely need a Copacabana in here then. Yeah, we're going to build a Copacabana and then buy one of those because we have one, two, two wonders out of the, here. Wait, what was the... On or adjacent to a coast tile. Yes, so there are plenty of those. Temple, why not? Foot, whatever. Sleep. This naturalist can come make this national park. Oh no, I need to switch. Oh no, I messed up. This builder can come build this iron mine. Actually, we can get ready for the Eiffel Tower. So I don't want to build that iron mine. I do want to take this major victory. Let's create a really just great work in the city center here. It doesn't even matter. Go to sleep. This builder can sleep. Oh, we're ready for... No, we're not. I thought we were ready for another seaside resort, but we're not. Let's take the extra gold. Ski resort here, and then another one up here. I want to remove this lumber mill so that I can build a mine. All right, we got another great musician. I thought this would be over by now, but it turns out it's not. We're going to go ahead and do the same thing before, as before. We're going to move the great work from... Where's another broadcast center? Broadcast center. There we go. Then we'll have to move and create another great work. Please move. Remove the improvement. What else can I do? I mean, I could build a Copacabana and start doing great persons. Could also build an industrial zone and power these cities. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, it's a plus three zone. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five, six. Yeah, let's just take an industrial zone. Why not? I don't know. I just need this game to be over. Ski resort here. I don't think I've ever had this high tourism this quickly. Yeah, we're victoring in 182 turns. That's not going to work for me. There's a national park. We can go ahead and buy another naturalist. And I think at this point, we're going to go ahead and back go back towards cultists because we have so many great work slots to fill. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh boy. We had better get Creaso Red and Tor, I'll tell you that much. Because if we don't, I'm going to be upset. All of my um, relics won't be useful. Industrial Era ends in four turns. Distributed Sovereignty is unlocked. 
two culture per specialty district. Yeah, that'll help us to get to unlocking more tourism boosts faster. So there's digital democracy. I think that's all of my things. Um, oh no, that didn't even, yeah. We got knocked out of Sima Tanaeum. We got knocked out of um, scripture. Ooh, that's not the right card. Scripture. Thank you, scripture. I could take Raj, even though it's pretty bad. I'll take I'll take gunboat diplomacy there and then what's my next policy slot? Um five year plan? Take more science? Well, actually, I could get more great person points per turn, like great merchant points per turn, because I'm not running a whole lot of great merchant things. Easily builds a factory and workshop in this district. That could be nice. I could just buy him. And then I can just get a factory and workshop in Campinas. It's actually worth some gold. And then I get a rebate on great per people points. Environmentalism, 25% tourism across my empire. Beautiful. Let's get an arena. Let's remove our improvement and then step out on the water. You can skip your turn again. This naturalist is under attack. So let's take our major victory here. Let's take an attack there. I'll get my builder back. I'm not going to step her to her death, but I'm going to just get her one tile over. There's our ski resort. I'm going to build a mill there. I think this builder is basically done. We can just have him chill out. It's another great work. You know, I was kind of expecting this to just fall apart all at once, just like boom, like a bunch of dominoes, but it seems like they're hanging on. Okay, we can build... Ooh. Let's go ahead and buy our great person here. Instantly build a factory and workshop in this district. Now let's just build our gold out of here. And so that means I'm free to do another thing, like maybe build a harbor or a Copacabana. I think I'll build a Copacabana because that way I can um, just run the great person project over and over. Speaking of which, I should be getting more tourism from these buildings. Like, let's not run the carnival anymore. Let's build an arena. Step into the water, let the... Oh no. Can I not build a national park here? Oh, I need to swap this tile. And there's a national park. Boom. I'm gonna have this builder come step on this tile and then make that a professional sports or a um, ski resort. Let's build this ski resort and then we'll build a lumber mill there. This builder can build a mine, I suppose. Or I could also build woods because that increases the appeal of those adjacent tiles. So we'll do that. This builder is done. Sleep. Oh no, I can't levy the military anymore. Oh, someone out scissorined me. So let's levy the military again. Let's actually prevent that from happening the next time. So let's put a couple more envoys in here. I'm still scissoring of everyone I need to be scissoring of. I'm going to grab another envoy in here. I think I'm going to skip my turn here. 
isn't it kind of horrific that I'm in um, the modern era and I still have inquisitors that are going to punish people for believing the wrong thing? It's kind of weird. That's definitely weird. I think that that's uh, there should be a time limit on inquisitors. He's happy that I'm levying a city state. Okay, I dig it. I just need these barbarians to be gone, man. I just can't have this. Oh, it looks like this is the national park it wants me to build, which is okay. I'll do it. So there's a writer from the modern era. There's Anna Karenina, which is widely regarded as the best novel of all time from people who friggin' know. I'm not one who knows. <laughs> the uh, Anna Karenina principle is a concept in stats. The opening line of Anna Karenina is... Uh, Happy families are all alike, but every unhappy family is unhappy in its own way. And that's thought of as data sets and stats. Like, uh, there's lots of ways that you can be a non normal distribution or a non normal data set. But uh, to be a normal data set, there's a limited specific number of qualities that you have to have. So there's 25% tourism across our empire. So now we've. We're generating a thousand tourism per turn. You know what? Let no one tell you that uh, watching Civ is not educational because I just dropped you in a, uh, a truth bomb there. I think there are more um, tourism buildings over here. Oh yeah, cultural heritage for sure. Cultural heritage is good. Let's move towards cultural heritage. Claim ourselves a great person. There's another portrait. So we need to move her to Salvador. And then do, down to Recife. Fortaleza is going to build a zoo. We're going to buy this tile. Oops. Boom. All right, so I can come take this builder back. This builder's done. The spy is going to promote, let's say counter spy, whatever. Do I have any tourism cards? I don't have any tourism policies yet, so get out of my face. Okay, so we've got another great golden age, right? Is Wish You Were Here yet? No, nope, there's no Wish You Were Here yet. I could take Heartbeat of Seam because I have tons of gold and I don't need to use it for any other purpose, whereas I actually am building wonders. But I'm not building wonders in the places that are have science adjacency. I think maybe Reform the Coinage is still actually the best. Because what is this going to do? Shave off a single turn? Maybe less than one because I'm mostly done with these. Okay, so we got a great musician. That's just grand. I'm trying to move them to broadcast centers. How is this themed. This old god obelisk is, the is that a bug? Yeah, that must be a bug. Yeah, it was a bug. Okay. So we want an art museum in here. We want an art museum in here. Let's steal gunpowder. We might as well. So there is a portrait. We'll come down here. And we'll actually move out of Recife. We'll move this landscape to Caridaba. Sure. Instantly builds a factory and workshop. Oh, we have another charge on him. Oh, I forgot that. Okay, so yeah, you can come over to uh, 
Come penis when you're done. This was a great, great person to buy. He was like a grand person. Oh, you came in and stole my build. Oh, that's really frustrating. Uh, whatever. We'll just buy another builder. Build a couple of woods in here to improve the appeal of these tiles. And also build a ski resort down here. All right, so there's another great work of music. Sleep there. Man, I thought this was gonna be over 30 minutes ago. Let's, um, I don't know, industrial city-state, why not? I'm gonna say that I gained two Diplo points. Whatever. Double points towards great artists. We definitely want that to pass. That's too much commitment. I feel like eight. Eight's enough. You know what they say about kids, right? It's the same thing they say about great artists. Holy crap, eight wasn't enough. Let's see. Nine points here. If I had gone up to 15, seven more, I could have gotten this. Yeah, that would have, that's annoying. Oh. Whatever. So we're seeing who gets the most great people. For oh, oh boy. <laughs> Oh boy, let me tell you. I didn't mean to go back into theater square festivals. I meant to get this tourism online. But you know what? It's worth purchasing. Whatever, 5,000 gold is like 10 turns. Let's build a sewer so we can grow. Why not? We're going to move our great person back over. So you move. So you can transfer to Campinas. And then in Campinas, let's build commercial hub. No. Harbor? Maybe. Maybe just a sewer. Digital democracy, synthetic. Technocracy? Did we unlock synthetic technocracy? What what did we unlock? I don't know. Alright, so there's a national park. Remove that pin. This build is gonna come over here and get some woods in here. I'm gonna keep these on alert. Seriously, what government? It must have been communism. There's computers. When we switch to computers, we're going to want to curb against climate change because we're going to have some sea level rise. We want to keep all of our seaside resorts. It's actually kind of an interesting uh, game design choice there to make seaside resorts still acceptable when there are floodwaters. Like, I don't think that I would want to go vacation somewhere that there's a giant wall blocking my view of the sea. But okay. I mean, it does give cultural um, civs a reason to care about those tiles. Let's see. We'll build floodberries after Eiffel Tower. What about in here? Three turns for flood barriers. Let's just stop, stop everything and build flood barriers really quick. Three turns for flood barriers. Four turns for flood barriers. So get your sewer first. As a matter of fact, how close were you to Broadcast Center? Yeah. Bello Horizonte. We definitely want to get flood barriers in here. Now put the art museum first. Shopping mall, then flood barrier. Porto Alegre. We need flood barriers for you because you've got a lot of uh, seaside resorts you're protecting. 
No flood barriers in the capital. We can purchase flood barriers for faith with um, Valetta. I didn't mean to do that just now, but we technically can. I'm going to do that for places that can't afford flood barriers on their own. Well, you know, most of them are, are okay. I would build a cold power plant here, but there's actually no benefit to that. Like, there's no adjacency on that um, industrial zone. Do we need flood barriers in here? No, we do need a sewer though. Why not? What about Natal? Flood barriers? No. Sure. I should make that into a seaside resort once I can. No flood barriers. Okay, I think that's it on flood barriers. Right? Oh, creative. Off. So that's it. There's computers that also gives us uh, tourism. I think maybe um, going towards electricity and getting these hydroelectric dams would be good. Oh, flight. We need flight. Because flight gives us uh, tourism on all improvements of ride culture. Which aren't any of our improvements. Never mind. Okay, whatever. Let's go for space race. So we're going to start moving our policy cards out of um, broad, like, swaths of culture and towards tourism. We're about to lose, yeah, 80 culture per turn, which is okay. Build a zoo, and then we have envoys to send. Could actually make up for it by becoming sort of a mammoth doll. Why not? Still says we're in available places that count. Let's trade with him. Portrait here. And then come down here. Why not? This builder can go back to sleep. And boom. Now this is actually worth buying a coal power plant for. We're accumulating 12 coal per turn, so. Someone built a wonder somewhere. Ruhr Valley. We weren't going to get Ruhr Valley. After a shift in... I lost Suzerainty of Valletta. I think Suzerainty of Valletta is no longer important. It has served me well, but it is time to retire it. If I didn't think this game were in the bag, I would be spending this faith on a bunch of cultists, but I really just don't feel like I can be bothered. Like, I feel like this game is going to be over in 20 turns, which is like the shift enter part of the, the game. Well, I suppose that, yeah, let's get some rock bands. Just get a few more. Oh, not rock bands. That was not what I intended to do. But uh, who's best in culture? I guess um, Norway is currently the culture leader. So I could come perform. Ugh. Yeah, now that I think about it, rock bands are probably the way to go because I have, um... Oof, stop. I think the game's about to end pretty quickly here. And so I would like to speed it up by generating a bunch of culture. So space race, 200% from great works of music. I think now we take near future governance to unveil, unveil this tech. Okay, let's go to rapid deployment. 
All right, this is done, so we can just go ahead and run Carnival. Broadcast Center in here, Cheese Production in here, Broadcast Center. So now we finally lose out on our science. So let's take... Oh, I don't know. Logistics? Why not? Let's move sports media out and let's move satellite broadcasts in. This rock band come out into the water and then... Oh no, I didn't mean to use up all your movement. You can come out into the water and take a name. Let's say Glam Rock because he's probably got more theater squares. I need to name you. All right, and let's just create a portrait here. Kaufman, Kaufman. Let's actually just buy. Well, I kind of don't want to because I'm going to have tons of great artists. I'm going to come over here and build the um, ski resort first. <gasps> we didn't get the Creaser Venator. That is obnoxious. That's obnoxious. Okay, do I want a different wonder instead? This would have been the perfect game to have a Creaser Redentor, and I think I got it early enough. Like, 215 is pretty early. Who built it? You don't even need it. What are you doing? You don't have any freaking seaside resorts. What are you doing? What are you doing that? What did you do that for? And I lost those rentee of somebody. Namadol. Just take it back. Well, I guess I could build three great artist points per turn. Can I not build it on here? It must be built along a river, okay. I'll take three great artist points per turn. Why not? So we want the artist and then also the writer. I'm going to move the great works of writing out of the capital. I don't think I really would have even changed my behavior. I just... Wait. Writer. There we go. I don't think I would have even really changed my behavior. I built it in the city that had the uh, most production, and I built it early enough, or at least I thought that I built it early enough. I just think that she went for it for some reason. They usually don't go for it that early. I don't. I don't think so, at least. So what is this promotion? Natural parks and natural wonders. Well, I guess we have to take that one, but I don't. There's a Luru over here, so let's do that. So then this rock band is going to come over here and probably tour at... Where's a friggin' theater square? Where is a theater square? He doesn't have a single theater square. Whatever. Okay buy a couple more rock bands before he bans them. Let's take our ski resort there. This is a three landscape. So where was our landscape? Karitaba. I'm just going to transfer you to Karitaba. Ooh boy. Ooh boy. Well, 
Let's take entertainment complex. And let's build a hydroelectric dam. Let's get out into the water. And then what, what are your promotions? Let's take goes to 11. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. Whatever, we're done with all of the techs. And let's build a dam in here so we have some power. Or wait, I don't need any power in here yet. Let's build an amphitheater. I feel like the city might need to build a Copacabana. Well, it doesn't even have a harbor yet. Let's take a harbor. Woods. There we go. Beautiful and damned. Let's go over here. This is, um... Yeah, let's go over here to, to Hamar. There's a landscape and that's a themed museum now. Step in the city. What's happening? Oh, oh, we're still waiting for the turn. Oh man, this is a this is a hurricane. So okay, this one's coming over here. Wonders or a special natural wonder. Hello, I'm right here. Did he ban rock music? No, I just gotta guess that didn't work. Whatever. I'm a little annoyed. I'm a little bit over the game. Okay, and then we can go to another venue at some point. I'm gonna do that later. Social media, definitely. Take a stadium. Escaped on foot. Uh, we lost a trade route capacity because this flood or this hurricane came through. Gonna take a turn to repair the lighthouse. Move this over here. Let's move. What did we take on here? goes to 11. So let's move you over here. Cool. There's a landscape. And then we can just make another landscape over here. It doesn't really matter. Did we get another tourism card? We didn't get another tourism card just yet. Oh, I need to move this Inquisitor inside. Step in the city here. There's another great musician. So I can move these great works. Great. Boom. Nocturne and E flat major. Build our aquatic center. Not too bad overall. So, where's another valid placement? Like right here, sure. Beautiful. I guess I should play like right here because that's a goes to 11 city. It's on the fault line of a bunch of different uh, civs. How close am I to winning now? 43 turns. Ugh. How is it that some other player... Oh no, I, I got it backwards. It was like, some other player has more culture than I do. That's not... That's not right. It 
if it were me playing like by myself i probably would be calling it here and just like moving away from this going and doing something else with my saturday actually i guess it's sunday so there's the eiffel tower that's going to make all of our um places better we can build seaside resorts in places we couldn't before oh this is a seaside resort now as a matter of fact uh, I'm just going to screw the production in here and come build a seaside resort as quickly as I can. This is a seaside resort now. This is a seaside resort. Nope. Still not a seaside resort. But this is a resort. And this can be a resort. This can be a resort. We'll come over here and chop the cattle. This is a resort. Is it not? Appeal. Charming. Only two. What? Well, now I feel like this builder has wasted his whole life. <gasps> oh, that's not what I meant to do. Whatever. I meant to build a uh, lumber mill there, but... I guess I couldn't because there's an antiquity site, but the game would let me chop because, yeah, you totally want to chop the rainforest. Most cases you do. Can I not perform a concert here? Yeah, I can. Oh, man. I thought that I already used my go to, goes to 11 ban, but whatever. I'm just kind of half assing it. I just want this to be over. Ah. Like, um, I feel like, literally, if you're still watching this, like, I'm making this for you, you know? And you're a very special person, because I don't, I feel like most people, once the game is kind of over, they lose interest. Not that I regret that you're here. Okay, let's take out laissez-faire. Um, let's keep laissez-faire in, because there's actually some great merchants that give you trade capacity. Did Sarah Breedlove already get recruited? I mean, she had to have, right? She's a an industrial era one? I mean, I guess not. Well, we're waiting around for her, so I'm going to keep that card slotted in. I don't think I need Seamal to name anymore. So I'm going to take online communities. And we're done. We can claim another landscape person, which is great. And we can claim Huck Finn. So, same thing as before. Moving from Rio to Sao Paulo. I'm really surprised I haven't won yet. And Salvador is a... Portrait City, right? Yeah, Salvador. And so let's just... Yeah, let's just move him down here. Let's build an art museum in here. Let's build... What next? We could build the Bolshoi Theater, which will give me even more great musician points. Or Broadway, or I could just build festivals. I think festivals is the right play because the game is close to being over. But I guess I need to continue to purchase rock bands, which are an important part of closing out the game. All right. I can build an oil power plant in here. That would give me plus three production, which is fine. It kind of sucks knowing that all of these seaside resorts are just that little bit worse. Through what I deem to be no fault of my own. That's a breathtaking tile. This is a breathtaking tile. Come do this one first. And then come do this one. Actually, we have this one over here to do it. Okay. Okay. 
Victory in 13 turns, finally. Like, at least it's imminent. I, mean, I know that it's not that way because I'm running rock bands, but... Uh, spaceports and campuses. Yeah, we do have a spaceport or a campus right here to play on. There's Rockefeller. Rock and fellow. Seaside Resorts and Harbors, we know of a couple of, one of those. Maximum Elephant. Let's uh, wake up and we need to name them. Oh, I guess we already did name them. Okay. Where's Rockefeller? We'll come to him later. Uh, just go to sleep. Mark Twain did another great work. So now build a mine here, and they'll build second growth forests here to make up for it. There we go. There's Breedlove. So, 10 turns we'll get her. I think I'm just going to outright buy her. I don't have anything else I really need to purchase with my gold. Getting 25% tourism now represents a lot. Oh, man. Oh, oh, whoa. This this was ready for a performance, wasn't it? I suppose this isn't my ghost to 11 one, is it? It's um, Arena Rock. So you need to go to an entertainment complex. Yeah, come over here. So there's a themed museum. <gasps> no, that's a portrait. Oh, I just messed up. I don't have any other landscapes waiting around. Victoria. Oops. Oh well. I'm, it's going to be a little bit before I get a portrait. Four more turns. That's okay. So I'm dominant over Cree now. So that's pretty good. Alright. Let's make a theme museum here. So one thing I could do is I could just move all of those great works once Breedlove happens. I can move all of the portrait great works out of Salvador because they're not sticky. They've been there long enough to move around and I can just move them to a different art museum like uh, Sao Paulo. Where is Sao Paulo? Yeah, down here. So let's build a stadium. Let's buy Breedlove. Yeah, it's going to take us 27 turns to get her. We can't afford to lose her to the Kree. And this is basically done. Let's build a Copacabana in here. This city, we can build a lighthouse. Let's put some forests in here. There's a seaside resort. Ooh, this can be a seaside resort now, so that's good. Come on. Waiting for the ball to spin. There's globalization. Doesn't really do anything for me. This boy is coming over here. Yep, choose production in here. I think we just build theater square festivals because the city's done. Oops, don't quit. Production in here. This video is two hours long already. Oh my god. Carnivals. And build a zoo. A little more time for breed love. And this is another landscape. Where do we have another landscape museum? I don't think we have any more landscape museums. We do have one in the old god obelisk in Natal. Let's move to Guarlhos. Where's Guarlhos? Let's go to Duke. Let's just move everybody to Duke. We'll build a, a landscape in Duke. Move this from Natal to Duke. Where is Duke? Art Museum. 
Are there any other landscapes to get rid of? I think that's good. I need to buy more um, rock bands. This was on his way. This rock band, boom. This rock band, boom. Next turn. And yeah, we have all of our tours and things slotted in, so I think we're good. Let's go to the next turn. Form a concert here. We leveled up. Seaside Resort here. Another forest here. Next turn, we're done. I can't believe we still technically don't have claim over this entire bay. Like, who else would uh, dominate these waters? Like, these are international waters in the middle of... Like, no, that doesn't make any sense. Sometimes the tile acquisition in this game is... <laughs> it leaves something to be desired, at least for me. I mean, there, there's not a whole lot of realism in this game. I mean, there is some. There's, like, a good amount. But uh, it's definitely supposed to be anachronistic, and it is supposed to be more like a board game than... Let's just take roadies. And... Build another trader. Why not? This builder can go to sleep. Landscape in here. Hmm... I'll take album cover art because those costs are right here. This rock band can go out in the water and I guess take roadies again. We're close. We're getting there. Okay, so we got a promotion. Where are we? Let's take I guess reggae rock, so we can go to a water park somewhere. There's a barbarian camp still? This late in the game? I mean, I suppose they're always here with us, but... Alright. Rock concert, first things first. There we go. Great person. It's time to buy breed love. Let's go and perform on this tile. Meanwhile, let's perform on this tile. Great. All the way we're done. Maximum elephant. Let's go for reggae rock. I don't think I see any water park tiles, but uh, you never know. Great musician. First of all, Breed Love, where are you? Oh, we bought her this turn, so that's fine. Great works. Move the music. Boom. It's time to declare alliances again. This is our portrait person. So I want to move these out of Salvador towards Porto Alegre. Where is Porto Alegre? Yeah, sure. Why let's go to Porto Alegre with our portraits. Probably should have done this a while ago. Where can we tour? I don't know, come over here. Or come to this. Whatever. Just uh, do something. Right. We need to re declare our alliances again. Friendship. 
alliance. We took a cultural alliance with him. I'm not gonna go for the gold. Friendship, alliance, religious. Friendship, boom, alliance, research, boom. Friendship, boom, alliance, military, boom. And then friendship, boom, alliance, economic, boom. That's fine. We need a seaside resort here. Let's go ahead and buy another rock band, another rock band. I don't think I have any other national parks to build. I should have built those a long time ago if I did have them, but I don't think I do. Not much to say, not much to do. There's the hermitage. Cool. Another great rider. I'm gonna move this here, this here, this here. Create a great work here. Move our great writings elsewhere. This portrait. Um, port portraitist, por portrait maker. Can theme that museum. All right, getting gold. Move the rock band out into the water and promote it. Oof, I want extra tourism. Let's take. Uh, pop star, why not? Name it. Cool, whatever. Great. Oh, I guess I didn't do a performance here. No, I'm trying to... Yeah. I was trying to move this rock band somewhere. This rock band is ready to come over here. This rock band can step out into the water and then take a promotion. Again, whatever. This one can come over here towards that. Now we're getting 25% tourism. Let's look at our great people. Yeah, we don't want her, but there'll be another merchant to get later. I can't believe this game has gone on as long as it has. Yeah, our victory is definitely imminent. We are reducing the stack, aren't we? Maybe? Who is the culture leader? Because I thought it was, uh, was Norway based on the stats, but I mean, it does seem like it's him. That's a cultist. Oh, I was like, is that a doomsayer or a soothsayer? Oh, forgot that this was apocalypse mode, but it's not. I don't really ever play apocalypse mode. It's just not my my not my favorite thing. I come over here and do this. We'll have this performance. Seaside resorts and harbors. So we'll do that. We'll perform at this harbor next. We lost that unit. Oof. Come over. Come on. This. Yeah, so we want to perform at this harbor. We want this one to perform at this harbor. This one is just a roadies, so we can really perform anywhere in this empire. Let me just check to make sure I did. I didn't actually reduce my 
tourism needed to win. So I think maybe I'm targeting the wrong player, which is uh, not quite good. Is it Tamiris that I should be targeting? Maybe it's Tamiris because she has more culture. Maybe she's accumulated more culture per turn over the game, even though it's... Um... Let's actually, let's experiment a little. Let's go to Egypt with it. I mean, I suppose that I've already used up all of my um, faith, but... <gasps> Ooh, I don't even have roots to her. One, two, three, four. I need a root to Tamiris. We need that, like, yesterday. Buy a trader. I can't. There's some other trade route somewhere that has been not been used. So there's a great work that's themed. Oh, this trader's asleep. Oh no. Okay, maybe that was it. Well, that's annoying. This has convinced me that it would be very hard to win a culture victory. Like, I don't know what's wrong. Like, I guess it is only a turn 228. It feels like it's so long in the late game, mostly because I've had such strong production early in the game. That's what it is. So really, I shouldn't have had this be as long as it was. I just decided to do one long um, late game video, but this was actually not the late game. Let's build a research lab in here, because we can. An aquarium. I'll come over here. I don't see any other places with portraits, do I? Manaus, but I can always just move that. Where are our landscapes? There's one landscape there. Oh, this place isn't themed. Chiu Yang, Chiu Ying. Oh no! Kritiv is not themed. That's a lot of tourism that I wasted. So I'm now dominant over Norway, which means that, yeah, it's definitely not Norway. It's it's uh, Tamiris that I need to be targeting. That would be another reason why this thing is taking so long. So let's get out of here. Like, I don't even care about being inefficient with these harbor boys. I need to just get these uh, rock bands to Tamiris' territory as quickly as I can. Okay. Information warfare. Cool. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, it's all good. This rock band, just come over to her territory as quickly as you can. Another hurricane. There's flight done. We can blame a great person, which is this great musician. I want them to get that level of diplomatic visibility over everybody's because so I can get that extra um, tourism. We'll build a Ferris wheel in here. Let's get a Copacabana. I don't even care if it gets pillaged. Actually, I'll just build it over here so it can't get pillaged. We do the same thing with this uh, great work of music. 
Just move it other places. There we go. Alright, there's a bunch of tourism. There's another, another bunch of tourism. That's not actually reducing my amount of tourism either. Or my uh, goal number of tourism. Let's just see what it does. It might update at the end of the next turn. Let's look at our culture victory. I'm winning in two turns. Let's perform here. Maybe it's actually Egypt. Alright, we can repeat our route. Those rock bands are doing way better than rock bands usually do. I'm gonna build a Copacabana here because um, that'll give me more tourism. There's a portrait, and then we'll move him and create a portrait. Can we move this yet? Yes, it's movable. So let's move it over to Curitiba. And then we'll move this to another museum. How about the Hermitage? Let's move this from Manaus to Garlhus. Perform here. And we'll create another great work of music. I think that's probably the last turn. Yeah, we're very close to ending. Gosh, we have 1,200 tourism per, or culture per turn. Cultural hegemony. I could have my rock band choose from any possible promotion. That could be good. I think I'd rather just phone it in. Yeah, we're going to win this turn. So... Anywhere. Over here. There's a bunch of tourism. This rock band can come over here and generate a bunch of tourism. Boom, tourism. Boom. Tourism. Next turn. That should be it. Portrait. Cool. Next turn. Next turn. There it is. Okay. Thank you very much for watching the this part. The worth of a culture is not measured by its accomplishments. But in how those accomplishments last and how they are remembered. The beauty that you have inspired our people to create will ensure that our culture stands for all time. Who boy, I did not this, expect this to take this long, but this was a really fun game. Uh, it reminds me how fun work ethic is, even though it is kind of broken. I don't really like to, to um, tout it out all that much because it's so good. But uh, I had a lot of fun with this one. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like my videos and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye for now.